The main characteristic of this project, I would say, is the size and variety of the vegetation. Sao Paulo has a history of being on a land that was totally covered by the Mata Atlantica. And the Mata Atlantica is a very rich forest with enormous amount of varieties of plants. And I thought that bringing back some of the uh, intensity that the Mata Atlantica has to the site would number one help to clean the air, help to keep it cooler, uh, just create an environment for the, for the people that are there and around them that is much more pleasant and enjoyable. So it has a role that is ecological uh, it, and it has a role that is, gives pleasure to people on a daily basis. And also because there's so few public places with greenery that I thought the, the, the addition of a large greenery to the city would uh, make an important statement. So we just looked at all the families of, the, that are, of trees that are in the Mata Atlantica and just took the ones that would really withstand urban conditions. And there's lots of them. I mean, you, Brazil has the richest flora that any country has. And I've been in many, so it's an incredibly rich flora. It just makes me happy to see it. 